large professor. He's another producer out of Queens. He asked me to be a part of, you know, working on an album for Nas. He brought Nas up to my house, and we um, was in the basement, and I was going through certain beats on, on disc. You had, you know, my beats were on, like these Radio Shack floppy discs. I had a bunch of those discs around, just with beats on them. And we found that one. It was a jazz sample, you know what I'm saying? I don't even remember making that beat. I, I know I made it in the basement, but when I made it, it wasn't specifically for anyone and, and until I played it for Nas. He started bopping his head and getting the vibe and getting the idea right then and there. It was a perfect match, you know, with his lyrics, you know, that beat. <laughs> 